What's up YouTube? How you guys doing? Uh, I'm back this week. It's Saturday. Um, as you may have noticed, there's a slight change of scenery. Um, we're really busy today. We're having a bunch of people over this afternoon. And the dogs needed to go for a walk. And I'm not going to have time to record any other time. So we're going to find out if I have the mental capacity to walk and vlog at the same time. Hopefully I won't fall down. Uh, first of all, well, this is my younger brother Jordan. Okay, what's up? And these are the dogs. This is Jazz. He's a big girl. And those are, I don't know if you can see them, but they're Gypsy and Molly. Molly's the brown and black one with a wiggle to her walk. So, one thing I wanted to talk about today is pet peeves. Things that annoy me. And maybe find out what things annoy you guys. Uh, one thing that really annoys me lately is when I'm talking to someone and they fail to give me at least most a, a good amount of their attention like if I'm talking to someone maybe on Facebook or something and they're you know I'm, I'm fine with multitasking that's that's cool I do that all the time but if you know I say hey what's up and they say hey back and then it's like 30 minutes before after my reply that they say something they're like yeah, sorry, I had to take my cat to the dentist, you know? It's, it's like, okay, you could have just told me that, and we could have talked later when you had time, and I wouldn't have wasted my time here. It's, I mean, if, if you can't give me your full attention when we're talking, or even, like, 50% of your attention, if you can't do that, I've, I've got better things to do with my time. And then we can just talk later when neither of us have things to do. I don't know, I, I find it kind of irritating because, I mean, I prefer, like, face-to-face -face conversation over electronic communication any day. Heck, I'd take a letter. Um, but even even when you're talking to someone face-to-face, -face, sometimes people do that with, you know, their phones, you know, they're playing a game, texting, whatever. And I'm horrible about this. I mean, right now I'm on a walk with my younger brother and I'm, I'm vlogging. <laughs> but, but, like... I think it's especially bad face to face is because you're right there. There, there probably isn't much of anything else for you to be doing, and you're deliberately ignoring someone. Which I know I'm bad about it, but I don't know. That's probably a place I could use some improvement. What do you think, Jordan? About something yeah, really important. yeah, that's what I do. Is I'll be in in our room. I share a room with him, and I'll be playing bass, and he'll come in with some uh, very important thing to talk to me about and I'll try to listen to him while playing bass and I apparently can neither play bass nor talk at the same time I guess I, I can I can talk and play bass at the same time but again my attention is divided I'm not gonna get as much out of that conversation as I would normally um, yeah sure I'm kinda of being a huge hypocrite here I didn't realize that that sucks what things irritate you Jordan um. kind of the same thing that you're doing you. Someone's just like, oh, hi, 15 minutes later, bye. Yeah. And it's just a useless conversation. Let's see, what else irritates me? Um, the fact that my arm is sore already from holding this camera irritates me. So I'm going to switch arms. That irritates me. Now you're on the left side. Um, so tell me down in the comments. Is that something that irritates you? Um, you know, people's attention being divided when they're trying to talk to you? Or are you cool with that? Um, or if not, if, even if you do, what, what are some of your pet peeves, you know? I know some people like things that I would never even think of drive some people absolutely nuts. Okay, here's another thing that irritates me. And it's gonna sound weird coming from me, but when I go over to like someone's house and there's an arrangement of pictures on the wall, and one side of the arrangement has more pictures than the other. Or if the picture frames are bigger, it looks heavier on that side. And it irritates the crap out of me. I just want to pull the pictures off the wall and just rearrange their entire decorations. All the decorations. I also count stairs. If the stairs aren't an even number going up a staircase, it irritates me. Yeah, same here. I count that because I do two steps at a time to make it easier. I do too. Occasionally three. Um, yeah, that's probably OCD. Huh. I, I deliberately have to keep my mind on other things when I'm going up staircases so that I don't count the stairs. <sighs> what else irritates me, dude? Um. 
I'm not a particularly irritable irritable person. I'm I'm usually pretty laid back and accepting. But when I when something does really irritate me, it bugs the heck out of me and I can't let it go. I that's one thing I don't like is people who deliberately try to distract you from something. Or heck I mean even if I'm like uh a game of like cards or uh, a board game and someone's doing something weird off to the side that is distracting it will bug me and it will mess me up not because I can't focus on the game but just because I for some reason find that irritating at the time and then my irritation distracts me from doing the game well so if you ever want to win against me in poker or something like that just have someone dance off to my side or have someone, I don't know, poke me with a pool cue, Ethan. What I like to do is when he's trying to vlog, I start shooting him with nerf guns. Yeah, that, that's irritating. So anyway, let me down in the comments uh, what some things that irritate you, you know? And what level of irritation do you, when you get irritated, are you usually able to just put it in the back of your mind and go on with things? Or does it just like eat away at you and you can't let it go? Uh, let me know about that. Uh, thanks for watching. Be sure to rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, come back next week for the next vlog. I'll see y'all later. Bye.